Hey everybody, welcome back. Ten more minutes to achieve building action. Man, them ten minutes goes by quick. Don't realize how quick minutes <laughs> goes by. Now we're going to do our ends. I hope you, hope you guys are paying attention because we are laying up a one piece molded hatch. That has plagued modelers for a long time. Um, they no one did this, man. All them kids a long time ago, you had to cut a hole in the fuselage and do all this out of wood. Man, I hated that. I mean, I made good hatches. Don't get me wrong. Now, I already got this cut. I made me little templates and cut these out with an X-Acto. I'm just going to lay them in there to where they're just a little bit short, just a frickle. We'll call that a frog hair. That's a frog hair right there. And they go up the sides, just a frog hair. And then, just nice and easy, work it in. This is what I like doing the most out of laying up parts is these little things like this. That's why I can't wait to get that my opening canopy mold done. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get that done. I just love laying up stuff like that. saturated anything hanging off trim it bang it bang it okay now that was our four ounce so what I'm putting on this people one layer of Four ounce and one layer of tin. So it's the same thing my fuselage is. And it seems to be just right. Nice and rigid without being super heavy. Okay, let's do this in the same way. We don't want to have to trim these edges if we can get away from it. You know what I mean? When you can just butt that glass right up to it and not have to trim it. What is wrong with that? That's all I got to do to these ends. That's it. And they will all become, it'll all become one piece. Because of my filler is cotton flock, not baking soda. You don't use baking soda here. And uh, I overlapped my glass. You know, I ran this stuff up that way just an eighth inch, and that way, that way, just an eighth inch each way. And, it all becomes one. Won't crack out later. When 
I mean, I've seen my first molded hatch on a jet, man. I was impressed. <laughs> And then I believe it was the yellow aircraft. That F-18 I built for my buddy back then. Well, I built a lot of yellow stuff that had no hatch either. Bang it. Okay, we'll put a little bit of that extra resin. We're still on. 
Yeah, see, you could have scraped that brush down.